guys welcome back to another video um we've got a little bit of she and stuff turn up today uh we'll start off with these um i've always used these ones and it turns off these ones even though they're meant to be link free they're not don't believe anything anyone tells you <laughs> so i've been using these okay which are lint free so i've actually bought two more packs from Shein because they're dirt cheap on there so i've got a blue and a green obviously because it's my favorite colors they've got quite a few colors on there and then next up i'm always using my dirty dirty look you can see how many times it's been used pinks purples lilac i can see a green on there and that ends even worse it is i dread to think how many colors is on that end so you can clean them to a certain point um like i could still carry on going on and using that one because the stuff's dried in it i just dab the end of it in a little bit of acetone or um isopropyl alcohol just to get the color off it obviously that's stuck in there so i thought i ought to get a new one because it's disgusting so i thought i'd get two i couldn't find the things on their own so i just bought two of the um kit ones so that's them what else have i got oh some little stickers don't know why i got this I've got loads of heart stickers so i'm not quite sure why i got them maybe i was thinking of something i was probably thinking valentine's will be coming around soon so in that pack oh blimey you've got quite a lot i thought there's only two in there so there's that one and that one which is the same then that one's sort of like, um, I'd call that more abstract art because it's slightly on the skewy. Whereas those two and that one, I'd say that's the proper shape for a heart. And those are like sort of slightly oblongy, they're stretched. So yeah, that's quite a nice little pack. I'll put it back in the packet in a minute. Uh, I've got another little ring for, or rather a big ring. Luckily they change. So this one has got the uh, butterflies all over it, but the three in the middle have got like a, a jeweled butterfly. But they're quite nice for putting on your wart. Flexi hand. There you go. One pinch and it fits. So that would look quite nice on there. I'm going to pull it off though. I've got to take a picture in a minute. <laughs> what else have we got? Some little bears up here. Yeah, I had two packets of these, not quite sure why I bought two packets. Don't know, not any idea at all. Okay, so they're all see through, but they're like coloured. Pink, yellow, green. I was going to use one the other day, but I didn't want it see through, so I coloured the backing. Might help if you put your camera back down, Joe. Should we bring it down a bit? Oh, forget about that. Okay. Yeah, I coloured the back of one just with some gel polish. So he wasn't quite as see-through. I think it was one of these ones what I did. But, oh, 
as I wreck the place. I'm having one of them days today. You know, one of them days most days. I'm going to put that back in there as well. So we've got two packs of those. We've got a pack of these, which I have already used one on a set. They're really nice. So I've used that one on a set, but I've pulled it back off again. Because all my tips go in the bin. But they're quite nice as well. I quite like those. They've got little uh, gems on them. So that was that. I've got some of these. I was going to get some of the little fluffy pom-poms. But I couldn't make my mind up what I wanted. So I'm hoping these are the things that I actually need. Which are little spinners. Yes they are. So what I might do is. Um, obviously it's too late to use them now as spinners. Um, but I was. I'm sure I'll find something else to put on them. But what I was going to do was put one on a nail and then maybe put like one of these snowflakes on so you can spin it round that was my theory anyway okay i want to do some kawaii nails at some point so i thought i'd grab some of these really not practical for going out with them on your fingers but some people do so yeah they're like sweets got a sweet packet I think that's quite cool it looks like you want to touch it and it's full of sugar but it's not it's quite hard and plasticky but it gives you that that feeling so those are what I've picked up that's quite nice because it's got like a clear bulbous bit so you can see the glitter in it and the mylar looks quite good got an M&M there these little lollipops that's got glitter on the bottom as well so that was that bag and then I also wrong side picked up a pack of these which are little tiny lollipops oh my god I love them how cute are they love that love it love it love it so you know what I'm going to be doing over the next few weeks. And last on the Shein list was these. Everybody's been using these and they're like um, what paper. Oh, as I knock the first one out. So they're ever so thin. They're just made of stiff card. So obviously... Put that on there. Can never open these boxes. Don't know what that one is. I'm not sure. Some kind of little tree. So there's two different colours in there. There's like a green one and a yellowy coloured one. Can you see through the bottom? I wonder. Of course you can. You dozy donut. So we've got more leaves in that one. I like these ones and I like these ones. So these are more like a maple leaf shape. And then these ones are on a branch, twig, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, so I got some of them as well. Which are nice and easy to store. So that is it for my Shein haul. 
I will also show you the other thing that arrived. I won't show you that bit because it's got my mail address on. So I've got two lots of these. They are free, but you pay, I think, postage and shipping or something. Um, yeah, postage and shipping is the same thing, isn't it? Ugh. Right, anyway, they are free from banana-print.co.uk. So I think you can only get them in the UK. Don't quote me on that. You're better off having a look. So I went on there and there's loads of templates. So you can go on there and just whack in what you want on, you know, written on there. So what I did was um, I used a partial template. It had already got some stuff on it. I removed the stuff off it, which is really, really easy. I am not computer, you know, let's put it this way. If anything goes wrong, I hand it to Richard. So for me to be able to do this was easy. Um, so I removed the stuff off it, which left me with the coloured background, like a rainbow background. So I popped my logo on and my Instagram and my YouTube and I have put all of my um, codes that I have available. I haven't put every single one on, like I do have a code for Glitter Planet. Um, but Glitter Planet is one where you um, have to go on and put your email address in, which is why I didn't put that one on. Um, otherwise I would have done but if ever I send anything from now on if you win a giveaway etc I will put one of these in providing I remember <laughs> no I will I'll put one in so I just thought it was a good idea to put up somewhere that if you wanted a code to use quickly you've got one right there so some of them are affiliate codes. Charlie's Nail Art one is, and the McCart one is an affiliate code, and the Madam Glam is as well. Madam Glam have given us a Bitly link now where you can click on the Bitly link. You don't have to put my code in, so you just literally follow through and it will give you 30% off at the end of it automatically. So, but you can do it the old fashioned way where you go via Madam Glam and put my code in right that is it that was all I was going to show you I have got tons of other stuff but it's just I just haven't got around to doing it yet I've not been very well and yeah the less said about that the better <laughs> I'm a bit fed up with it to tell you the truth right I'm going to leave you in peace guys I hope you enjoyed this I have put another Shein order in so I expect some more stuff to turn up at some point probably after new year um so yeah right i'm gonna leave you in peace it's been quite long um if you like my video please give it a thumbs up it helps so much um like push my channel further and further and i would love it if you'd subscribe if you're not already if you want me to sub sub leave me a message in the comments um I don't get around to the comments straight away, but I do get around to them eventually and answer them. But as I said, I've not been very well. I'm still not well. Um, I'm still coughing my guts up and trying not to do it now. <laughs> um, yeah, so unfortunately. But yeah, I would appreciate it anyway if you would subscribe and leave a comment. And I will answer you eventually. <laughs> right, I'm going to leave you in peace. Thanks for watching. Bye.